Hey, check this out. Look what's at the scanning station. My name is Burf and this is my turf. I'm straight out of the thrift store. Hey, what's up? It's your boy Burf and we are at the Goody Wheel. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. What you got for me today, Goody Wheel? What you got for me today? Hopefully you got some vintage toys for your boy. So we're gonna go in there, we're gonna keep our fingers crossed and pray, pray that the vintage Goodwill gods are good to me today. Man, it is windy out here. It's hot as heck, 104 degrees, but it's also windy. All right, guys, well, this is a first. So I'm in the middle of Goodwill right now and the grid just went down. Would you say it's time for everyone to panic? Yes, I would, Ken. We've got no electricity. It's kind of dark in here, even though my camera shows it's uh, looks a little lighter than what it is. Uh, but hey, check this out. I just found this SpongeBob SquarePants lunchbox, but it's got like arms and legs on it and shit. So it's really awesome. They only want 99 cents for it, but the cash registers are down. So I don't think I can buy it, but my Goodwill hookup is working up there right now. So maybe she'll just let me put 99 cents, a dollar cash down and uh, maybe she'll let me get it. So we'll find out. But in the meantime, let's see if there's anything else on the shelves. All right, well, what else do we got? It's kind of hard to see a little bit in here. The fireman's hat. What's this say? Buzzed blocks, but there's like nothing in it. It's like an empty box. An empty box. Oh, <laughs> hold on. Let me, let me do that again. An empty box of buzzed blocks. Look at that, I'm already rhyming. All right, there's like a chess set. I think that's Parcheesi or something, right? What else? Great Wolf Kids. What's this right here? Like a little, a little lightsaber. It doesn't have the saber part of it though. All right. Uh, we've got a dino. A little wiener dog. Anything over here in plushy land? What's this little zebra? And what else? What's this guy here? Oh, he's a lion. Here's a little baby lion. Ducky. This is a, uh, yeah, Dr. Seuss. Oh, he's got his nose all ripped apart. Oh, look. Well, it was on for a second. Oh, check this out. We got a Spider-Man like lunchbox cooler. That's cool. Yeah, boy, we setting records out here. This is the first thrift store toy hunt I've ever done in the dark. Now, what do we got here? Oh, we got the shark bite game. Let's put this over here. Shark bites, let's see. Oh yeah. There he is, Mr. Jaws. All right, what do you guys think? Are these sunglasses me? Or do I look shady in the dark? <laughs> Get it? Sunglasses, shades, shady. I tried to make a joke. Well, unfortunately, my hookup was not at the register. So she was in the back and... Uh... Oh, there, I'm way over there. <laughs> I was like, for a minute, I thought somebody stole my car. Um, and it's really windy, isn't it? But uh, yeah, so my uh, hookup wasn't there. The manager was there. I asked the manager, hey, can I just give you a dollar for this? He said, no, you'll have to come back tomorrow. As long as you come back within 24 hours, you can uh, pick it up. We'll, we'll hold it for you. So apparently, there's cop cars down here. It looks like somebody might have hit a pole and knock the power out on the whole block. So, cause all the businesses up along here have no power. That's what they were saying in there anyway. So, all right guys, well, let's go hit up another Goody Wheel and then we'll probably try a Target, a Target, by the time we end this toy hunt adventure. All right guys, a little change of plans. We're just gonna hit up the Target because 
the cops had the road all blocked off and I was gonna have to circle around and head back a different way and it's just too much, too much for me. So, all right guys, well, let's keep our fingers crossed and pray that the target gods are good to me today. All right guys, here's the rock. Looks like he's wearing a skirt. <laughs> and then what's this? Bray Wyatt with this little pig. Looks like he's got like tar all over his face. There's Mustafa. All right, what else we got? Oh, that's that uh, that trans thing. I don't know. So here's uh, let's see, what is this? John Silver. Oh, they do have the wrestling ring. Let's go. What's down on here? Now we got Goldberg and Drew McIntyre. Looks like we got a couple of those. We got three of them. All right, what else? Oh, Motu action figures, $32.99, now $16.49. That's got to be him, right? That's got to be Beast Man. 50%. I can't imagine. Motu Faker. Yeah, it says Motu Faker is now only $9.89, but he's gone. Oh, no, here he is. So, wow, that's cheap. I already, I have him actually already. But I'm going to definitely get me a Beast Man for $16.49. Come on now. Uh, here we've got some more. We've got uh, Fisto. Do we have like a Merman in here anywhere? That would be cool. Doesn't look like it. Just Fisto and this and Andra Chick. Skeletor. I've got him. Skele God. I've got him. Here. Whoa. Motu. Oh, mini figs. Oh, these are $2.49. For a second, I thought these guys were $2.49. I was like, oh my God. <laughs> I'd buy everything. All right. Whoa. So all right, let's put him back. But yeah, we'll definitely grab a beast, man. And I still need to do that video where I open up all my Revelation figures. And what else do we got? We got the Battlefield Warriors. I've got that. I've got the Stridor. I've got the Panther. Mine's actually flopped. And what else? We got King Grayskull. I don't have him. Not yet, anyway. We've got some Buzz Lightyear stuff. Mirrorverse. Several Buzz Lightyear figures. They don't seem to be moving too well. And we do have some Jurassic World down here and Dominus Rex. Scorpio Venator. Okay, Scorpius Rex. Here's a Camp Crustaceous Pack. Tyrannosaurus Rex Escape Pack. The Apatosaurus, the, uh, what do they call that? The Colossal, right? Oh yeah, check out this, that's new. I haven't seen that one yet. And of course, as usual, the only Star Wars we have is Mr. Peg Warmer himself, Lando Calrissian. It's all Lando. And then we got this IG-11 with a mixture of Lando in there. Nobody likes Lando. Oh, check out the Pokemon. I think we got some new stuff here. I didn't see this last time. Due to high demand and to support all guests, we will be limiting the quantity of Pokemon trading cards to five items per guest. Okay. Akito. Yeah, listen to this brat over here talking about his mom won't let him get anything. She's been telling him the whole time. Just pick something. All right, so we've got some Sonic. Here's some Mario. All right, what do we got over here? Oh, we got Gung Ho. That's cool. Akiko. We've got the Baroness. And we've got some... Storm Shadow, Scarlet, more Baroness, looks like a Lady J back there. And then over here, we've got Snake Eyes, we've got Red Ninja, lots of Red Ninja, and lots of Snake Eyes. I think that's Flint. Yeah, I've got a few of these Super 7s, but just because they were like, I think $8 when I got them. I'll never, oh, whoa, look at this. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I was going to say, they used to be $17.99. No, they're $19.99, but that's the classified. But still, $17.99. Come on now. So we've got a Power Ranger here. Spider-Man Nano Metal Figs. Those are kind of cool. We've got our DC Multiverse over here. Just 
some of the same old, same old, nothing new. Here's some transformers. Now this one here is kind of cool. There's that kickback. And then we got Dinobot Snarl, Megatron, Fusion Mega Shot. They have him as like a tank. Bring him back as a gun. I ought to start a movement. Bring Megatron back as a gun. Buzzworthy and Bumblebee. Or that's Buzzworthy Bumblebee, not and Bumblebee. All right, oh, King Shark. Oh, these are cool. I've got a few of these figures. That's actually, that's actually pretty sweet. Eight bucks, but hey, it's all right. Who do we got down here? Batman versus Hush. We've got this, you know, very strange face sculpt Superman. It's like beefcake Superman. Look how fat he looks. And then we've got Clayface over here. Oh, look at this. Autobot Optimus Prime converting RC. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> how much do they want for that? $70. Holy cow. That's way out of my budget. Oh, this is a cool looking Venom. And man, the uh, the Marvel Legends section is weak, man. It's just those two guys right there. Same figure. Actually, there's a, there's a different one back here. Who is this? Marvel Sleepwalker. Oh, he's kind of cool looking. Oh, I see. They moved their Legends out here to the end cap. But still, there's not not much, man. Not much at all. There's a Gigantosaurus. We got some masks over here. Here's a little like four pack. Mosasaurus, Tyrannosaurus Rex. All right, guys, well, let's go check the NECA section and see what's in NECA's neck of the woods. We also need to scan this guy just to make sure he is $16.99. All right, what do we got down here? We got some turtles. Man, you know, I never see these guys on sale, ever. And then we've got lots of, uh, like, anime stuff. Dragon Ball, Goku, those sorts of things. Over here, we've got some Stranger Things. We've got these uh, Super 7 Power Rangers. I like that Ultraman... Ultra Mantiga, he's pretty cool. We got Superman, Princess Bride, here's some turtles. And this little section right here is just kind of a wreck. There's just stuff everywhere. And what do we got down here? We got a Godzilla. <laughs> Phantom of the Opera. And we've got a Chucky. And then we've got the Nightmare Before Christmas Sally. Here's more turtle stuff. I've seen this guy forever in a day. And what's down here? Oh, here's a Batman. Batmobile. That's cool. The Bat cycle with the sidecar. Nice. What's this? Oh, it's the same thing. And then we've got a new King Kong. I haven't seen this one before. He's definitely new to me. It looks like his uh, face might interchange possibly. I don't know. Maybe not. Uh, more of these guys. We got some Funkos. We got some Spider-Man, Madam Web, Harry Potter, Man and Battle Cat. Here's another General Ursus. I should see if uh, the last one I picked up was only five bucks. I should scan him too. And what do we got down here? We got Wingnut and Screw Loose. And we've got some Kong. Oh, look, his, uh, his face kind of came loose. His second sculpt. Some gremlins. That's a new one. I don't think I've seen him before either. We've got some Defenders of the Earth. I mean, the Merciless. A little Flash Gordon. We've got these micro action figures. A little Starscream. Oh, look at these guys. It's like someone tried to steal them. All right, check this out. Halloween 3, Season of the Witch. Oh, wow, that's cool. Let's scoot the rest of this out. Now that 
is a nice little three pack. They also come with extra face sculpts. This Halloween TV, they got extra hands. Yeah, that's awesome, man. I, oh, I really dig this. What the hell, let's scan this too. You never know. I mean, I've seen it before, but I don't see it all that often and it might be on sale. Uh, we've got Michael Myers. And what's this, Masters of the Universe Funko? Oh, Evil Lynn. And it even comes with a t-shirt, extra large. That is cool. I like that t-shirt. And we've got Muck back here. Well guys, let's go scan this stuff and see if we get lucky. Hey, check this out. Look what's at the scanning station. That is freaking awesome. It's die cast. Oh man. All right, we gotta scan this too. I might bypass Beast Man and get this thing if it's the right price. All right, first up, let's scan General Ursus. What's he going for? Uh, $14.99. All right, we're gonna put you back. Up next, let's scan Beast Man. $32.99. Well, I ain't paying that for you. All right, we got Halloween Season of the Witch. $52.99? Shut the front door. All right, I'm scared to find out what this thing is. Oh, $24.99? He's actually the cheapest one. I think I'm gonna get it. Actually, he doesn't transform. Check this out. That's how you see Optimus Prime in his transformation. Yeah, I ain't paying $24.99 for something that doesn't even transform. Man, what's going on today? All right, I'm gonna take a picture of this. Masters of the Universe, $32.99. He's $32.99, now $16.49. I'm gonna take this up to customer service and see if they'll give it to me for $16.49. All right, guys, we did it. So even though it was originally $32.99 and it wasn't ringing up on sale, I took a picture of the clearance price and she gave it to me for $16.49. And that right there, boys and girls, is how you do it. <laughs> nice, another one, another revelation added to my collection. I gotta get that Fisto next. But hey, if you guys are enjoying watching this content as much as I'm enjoying making it, before you do me a favor, smash that like button. That really helps me out. It helps my channel grow. Because when YouTube sees that you like my stuff, they tend to show my stuff to other people that are just like me and you. People that like collecting toys, toy hunting, all the good stuff, right? So smash the like button. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. I got a lot more great content coming your way. And I've got over 500 videos on the channel that you can start binge watching right now, starting with this next video. I know you're gonna love it.